Hi everyone, I'm WeatherWorks meteorologist Brad Miller with another edition of Weather 101. Today's topic, cold front versus warm front. We'll have much more on that in your Weather 101 after this. Hey, welcome back. Weather 101 again. Today is our topic cold front versus warm front and uh, pretty easy to determine the two. You can tell just by the title of each of the fronts, but there's an example of a cold front right through the middle of the United States and here's a warm front right there into Canada and we see this every day in weather and usually what drives the weather from west coast to east coast here in the United States and really all around the world. Cold front basically exactly what it means cooler air mass on one side of it, warmer air mass being replaced by the colder air. Sometimes in wintertime it's Arctic air, temperatures uh, heading down below zero, but uh, definitely a difference between one side of the front versus the other. Warm front, basically the same idea, but the warm air is overtaking the cooler air. Usually it's moving north, and a lot of times you will get precipitation ahead of a warm front. Same thing in a cold front as well, but a lot of times when you get a warm front overtaking the cooler air, you get some precipitation, especially into the winter time, but usually on one side of the front it's warmer versus north of the front where it's usually cooler, but those are the two types of fronts that we uh, typically deal with every day here in weather. Also, we do have what's called a bonus stationary front. And same idea, cooler air on one side, warmer air on the other side of the front. Usually it's not moving all that much. Sometimes it may waver a little bit throughout the day or into the uh, overnight period, but usually it doesn't move all that much. It's not like a cold front that's moving quickly east or a warm front that's lifting quickly to the north. Uh, usually we get a lot of this in the winter time where you get winter precipitation on one side of the front, usually the north side, and then you get rain on the southern part of the front. But uh, something, again, we deal with in weather just about every single day. That's your edition of Weather 101. Don't forget, we are WeatherWorks. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, also on LinkedIn and Instagram, and check out our YouTube channel, and always at our website at weatherworksinc.com. Again, I'm meteorologist Brad Miller.